If your chat GPT is lagging or it's giving you slow responses, then here's two fixes that you can do and some practical advice to get your chat GPT working faster. So the first thing you need to know with chat GPT, if you have a very long chat, there is going to be so much chat history. And as you can see, it loaded quite slow for me. This is because this is a very long chat where I was trying to configure a gaming PC. Now, you need to know that ChatGPT, when it answers your question, it goes through all of the history. So if you have loads of history in one chat with ChatGPT, what I would recommend you do is ask it to give you a summary and then put that summary in a new chat. So here's what I mean. So this is a chat about a gaming PC. I'm building one, right? And I'm going to ask it to summarize what it knows about this chat. So I've just put this chat is getting too long and slow. Can you summarize everything in this chat so I can paste it into a new chat? And we're going to get ChatGPT to do that. Now, I could sit here in real time, but as you can see, my ChatGPT for this chat is quite slow. So what it's done is it's given me an overview. It's then asked you in a short one paragraph version. I'm going to put here yes and give me context. So while that's doing that, Another thing that you need to understand is your internet speed is going to depend on how fast it gives you answers. So what it's going to do is it's going to take all of the chat history and it's then going to give you answers based on your internet speed. So if it's currently a bit slow or you're not on the fastest internet, that could also be a reason. As you can see here, we've got context and we've got exactly the summary of this chat, which we can go ahead and paste into another chat GPT chat. And then hopefully that one is a bit faster as it doesn't have to process so much data. So those are two quick tips. Let me know in the comments if those are useful. And if you have any tips of your own, put them in the comments as well. Thank you.